What's good with y'all? You feel me? So look, I told y'all we was gonna react to every single part of this interview. So y'all know what time it is. But look, before you scratch it up for like the video, subscribe channel if you new. If you scratch it, go. On. It's like I had an out of body experience. You feel me? Soon as I got hit, like, like man, I put this on my dead grandma Terry Gray, man. I'm like, man, I swear to God on everything I love, man. I'm like. But I think about this shit every day, like, nobody know, like, what I went through, like, somebody else would have panicked. Man, it's like, man, it's like, I don't know, like, like, it's like the devil was coming to get me, like, it's like my, like, like my soul, like, I can't even explain it, man, like, it's like my soul left my body, and I was up in the air. Mm -hmm. And I was just looking down, watching myself, all that, just watching everything going on. Ma'am, I swear to God. I said, Lord, please let me make it home. I come from... <clears throat> Listen, bro. Quando Rado got a daughter, bro. King Von got kids. I don't even know why this shit even had to happen, bro. You feel me? Some of y'all think it's Quando Rado fault. No. Y'all just hating on that nigga. It's King Von's fault, bro. If that nigga wasn't on no hot shit, bro, none of this shit would have happened. King Von would have went home to his kids, you feel me? Quando Rondo, you feel me? Quando Rondo was going home to his kids regardless, you feel me? But King Von, on the other hand, that man right there, uh, this is just horrible, bro. This is just horrible. Now, some of y'all was in the comments talking about it was not even, not even comments, bro. Y'all was just disliking the video because y'all heard the truth. I don't care. None of that stuff fazed me, bro. Y'all can dislike the video. At the end of the day, y'all watching the video, hearing facts. Now, if you don't want to put your pride to the side and admit what I said was right, y'all can just dislike and hop off the video. It don't matter. But y'all gonna hear it straight up from me. And that's all y'all gonna hear. But see, yeah. Like, I come from praying people. Now, I know, like, like, come on, man. No matter what I do in life, nobody too good to be close to God. Facts. I don't care... How much of a killer you is, how much of a rich person you is, how much of a big dog you is, how much of a stand-up dog you person you is, like it don't matter. Anybody could be close to God, and I I pray a lot, even though I do what I do, like even though I know I ain't living all the way right. Nobody perfect. Yeah. We human. I still pray to God. I just, I'm like I'm like Lord, please like just on some out loud screaming job like out of body experience type job like Lord, please let me make it home. It's like everything went back normal, and I've been back down. I you can tell Quando Rondo has a good head on his shoulder, bro. You feel me? He's young. He's a young ass nigga, bro, trying to get this money, and that's what comes with this rap shit, bro. Niggas gonna either hate on you, they gonna have beef with you, and all that shit, bro. You just gotta know how to deal with that shit. Like, you can't be out like you was out. You feel me? King Von was supposed to be home. Nah, that nigga wanted to go out and shit. If he didn't go to the club that night and just went home like he was supposed to, none of this shit would've happened, bro. None of it would've happened. But no. King Von was on Demon Time, and he knew. As soon as he saw this nigga Kwando, it was through. <sighs> King Von fans, I'm sorry. Rest in peace, King Von. But y'all gotta realize that this is low-key King Von's fault, bro. <laughs> this is low-key King Von's fault. I'm not trying to sound like a dick or whatever y'all trying to make it seem. But it's the truth, bro. Y'all gotta deal with it. You feel me? All this happened because of that man Von. You feel me? Fuck. It's not boo. But that nigga Von did sneak this nigga and destroyed this nigga's face socket. That nigga fell to the floor as soon as he hit. I'm not even going to speak on that shit. Horrible. But yeah, the snot boo. I know is I look up and I see my partner on the ground. You feel me? Shot up. So I'm like, he's shot. He's shot. Like, I'm like, he's shot, y'all. Like, I'm screaming out, my partner shot. Because, mm -hmm. mind you, he got shot four times right. that exact night. 
And a couple months before that, like, with a couple of incidents, I've been in my hometown, he's been shot five times. Uh -huh. Like, this man, I took nine. Wait, what, bro? I thought he was yelling Vaughn got shot at first. See, now I'm confused, bro. I don't know. I don't know. Because some people would say he was screaming Vaughn got shot. But he say he didn't know Vaughn. It was Vaughn until later that day or that next day. See, I don't know, bro. This is just horrible. I don't know. But I'm not going to take back what I said, though. Vaughn did this shit, bro. He did that shit. And now we got to live with that shit, bro. Fuck. A couple months before that, like, with a couple incidents, I've been in my hometown, he's been shot five times. Uh -huh. Like, this man, I took nine bullets. Right. You feel me? Five times a couple months before the incidents, four times that night. And there were other shootings going on in that man, there was so many people shooting, man. If you was there, you wouldn't even... If you was there, you would be hurt from everything that's going on because nobody really know. Bro, I would have instantly shit in my pants if I heard gunshots, bro. Gunshots and all that gun violence and shit be scaring me, bro. I'm not even with none of that shit, bro. That's why That's why I don't even go out no more, bro. Because shit like this happened 24-7 now. And it's not just regular people, nigga. It's cops and all that shit, bro. Shit's just out of there now, bro. Niggas just going crazy. Nod boo. Nod boo. You feel me? I see my partner shot up. Like, a lot of people saying that I was trying to take bro chain. Like, ma'am. See, that's that's the part where I'm getting confused, like bro. It's like being in Afghanistan and two soldiers shooting it out with two other soldiers and a bag of money in the middle of the ground. Ma'am. You think people in the middle of a shootout, you think so many bullets flying, you think people think about that bag of money? Well, I saw his manager track say he Hell didn't even no. think he had a chain on that night. Ma'am, I don't, ma'am. But he wasn't sure. But. I'm not even sure, ma'am. <laughs> For real, bro. But a not chain, ma'am, that... Ma'am, when they come to jury, ma'am, only, only... People with bad intentions, who cloud chasing and stuff, looking to try to take a nigga chain. Yeah. Now, Jewelry wasn't even important at this point in time, bro. Niggas was getting shot at, bro. Bullets flying everywhere. Ain't nobody worried about a chain. You feel me? I'm trying to get out of there with my life. I mean, fuck all that. You feel me? That nigga kind of don't have money, bro. Like, ain't nobody worried about no other nigga chain. No. The nigga King Von ran up on this nigga. Y'all got to just deal with the fact, bro. Ain't nobody worried about no chain. You, the, the King Von decided he wanted to destroy this nigga. And that's that's what he came to do. King Von decided he was finna come and destroy this nigga. Not, fi not mentally, like physically type shit. Not shoot the nigga. But beat him up type shit. Destroy that nigga. Clearly, he fell on the floor and got destroyed. Nigga. Anyways, back to what I'm saying. Ain't nobody worried about that nigga chain, bro. Y'all just angry at this point, bro. It's okay. It's okay. Rest in peace, that nigga King Von. It's okay. Y'all just got to deal with the fact. I know it's sad. But yeah, not boo. $50,000, $60,000 chain, man. Like, a nigga could go buy that. That's $50,000, $60,000. Exactly, like, that's not nothing. Plus, little Tim over here got shot. What I'm saying? I'm fucking partner over here. I'm knowing his bad situation. He just got shot up. I mean. What if he die with him? So I'm screaming out, he's shot. He's shot. You feel me? Like... Um, man, I'm like, I don't, um, I don't know where none of that came from. Right. I never, I never in life, ma'am, I never in life, ma'am, never in life had words with them, ever. And you, at this point, didn't know who it was either. Ma'am, I didn't know this was him. <laughs> This nigga, this nigga, this nigga is trying to be so polite at the same time, but we know what he want to say. We know what he want to say. That man word, we know what he want to say. But yeah, I'm not going to get into that. Ma'am, I swear to God, on my soul, ma'am, like, like, ma'am, this is on neighborhood crook, ma'am. <laughs> I did not know that was him to the next day. That's the end of the reaction for me. Look, we going to wait for part three because y'all know. 
I'm gonna keep it G and react to it, bro. And if y'all don't like it, I'm sorry to tell y'all. Rest in peace, King Von, you feel me? I don't even know why this day had to happen, but you feel me? We gotta live with it. We gotta live with the truth. King Von did what he did, you feel me? And that's just what it is. Free top tillers backers. Don't forget to like the video, subscribe channel if you're new. We out of here. Boom.